Madam President, I ask unanimous consent that the Judiciary Committee be discharged of S-3462, a bill to provide subpoena power to the National Commission on the British Petroleum Oil Spill in the Gulf of Mexico, and that the Senate then proceed to its consideration. Is there objection? On behalf of other members of the Republican Conference, I object. Objection is heard. Madam President. The Senator from New Hampshire. Madam President, I ask unanimous consent the Senate proceed to the immediate consideration of calendar number 442 H.R. 5481, a bill to give subpoena power to the National Commission on the BP Deepwater Horizon oil spill and offshore drilling, that the bill be read a third time and passed, and the motion to consider be laid upon the table with no intervening action or debate. This is legislation that passed the House 420 to one. Is there objection? On behalf of other members of the Republican Conference, I object. The objection is heard. Uh, Madam President, the I Senator think, from New Hampshire. I, I don't understand what is so objectionable. In the House, 169 Republicans voted in favor of giving the Presidential Commission subpoena power. They understand how important that is because this commission begins their investigation in the next few weeks. This should not be a partisan issue. I don't understand why my colleagues on the other side of the aisle are turning this into a partisan issue. I find it unbelievable that after everything the people of the Gulf region have endured and that this entire country has witnessed for over two months now that anyone is still standing with the oil company that caused this disaster instead of the victims who are suffering from it. I hope the American people understand that this is a clear contrast between who stands on your side and who stands on the side of special interests. How is it possible that members of this chamber find it difficult when the House of Representatives in a near unanimous vote could say that the subpoena power is necessary for the commission to be able to get to the bottom of what happened, could pass unanimously there, say for one vote, and yet cannot even proceed here. Cannot even proceed here. This isn't rocket science. It's common sense to most Americans. We need to fully learn the lessons of this disaster with a thorough investigation, not protect oil companies from having their negligence exposed. We need to get answers from BP and Transocean and Halliburton and everyone else, including the federal agencies, not give apologies to them as I have seen Republicans suggest that we should apologize to BP for making sure that the residents of the Gulf region are held whole. We need to know the truth, and the Commission needs the power to get the truth. So who are you protecting, and what are we hiding here?